Hello everyone, it's me again, G-Deli Fan the Softcore Brony, 99% on Let's Play <laughs> Ori in the Blind Forest. Uh, I must be at like the end of the game. Is this like a finale now or what? I mean, there's like nothing left to do. Oh boy. Except, go... This is already cleared out, huh? Interesting. Oop, wrong button again. Uh, it doesn't look like I can do anything over there. This looks like something, but... Is this just another escape sequence? This is gonna be some other stupidly hard escape sequence, isn't it? Oh yeah, this is gonna be another escape sequence. The last one? Wow, and basically kill her and her baby. I guess they just literally can't survive in life. Great. Now where do I need to go? Can't move. Is this like a final battle? Because it's going kind of slow. Oh, look at that. Ow. Oh, is it like hiding behind stuff again? I just feel like moving as fast as I possibly can regardless of damage right now, so... I... Obviously, I can't save, I'll bet. That ain't cool! Oh, wrong button. Oh, dang it! Well, that sucked. Oops. I didn't quite land on it. I'm having all kinds of problems now. Yeah, thought so. Uh, can't reach that. Please save. This has got to be some kind of final battle going on here. Oops. Oh, dang it. I was so close. Could there at least be a... Ow, I keep forgetting about that. Checkpoint. Where do I go 
from there? I don't know! Oh, I have a draft. Safe zone! Wait. Oh, dang it. I'm screwed. How? Oh. Oopsie. Oh, I can't go that way. Okay. Oh! That wasn't fair. Ow. Am I almost there? Uh... Crap. <sighs> Gets tiring doing this over and over again, but... Well, when I don't really know what to expect, that's kind of what... Uh, well, you have to expect. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, I got that at kind of the last second there. Darn you, Kuro! Oops, I'm pretty much screwed! No! Oh, wow. I thought I did that just a little too slow, but not bad, not bad. Okay, this part. Whoa, get in there, get in there! But I... Not sure where to... Ow... What do I do now? Where do I go? I don't know where to go from there. Kind of, why is that bouncing back and forth? Oh, crud. I wasn't doing that in any of the other runs. Ow! That never happened in any of the other runs either. Why is there, like, more fire this time? Am I, like, that much slower or what? Get in there! Hmm. The sound in my headset is starting to die. That's bad. I'm gonna need to get a new one. Get up there! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. I know she's gonna come, so... She? Where do I go from here? But now what? I don't know. I love this escape sequence, but it's just that last part, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I mean, that's probably not even the last part, but it's just not obvious how I'm supposed to get out of there. I'm dead. I'm not dead! I'm 
I'm alive! Okay, so I just had to hit. Okay, I'm 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 good. Okay. The forest is on fire. That was a lot of words for please get up. <laughs> Yeah, of course, I didn't realize I could grab onto those rocks. For what? Getting rid of Kuro? For, like, I don't know, killing her once and for all? Get up, Ori! Do I have control of this? Yes, I do. But I think the hard part's over because all I can do is walk. One step more. That looks a lot further than one step. <laughs> oh, we yeah, have one step if you count floating with a feather. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. We have basically infinite lives. This shouldn't be a bad thing. Ah! Naru! Oh, I'm taking control of her again. Get to Ori! Where is he? Don't you see, Kuro? You and Naru are the same. You both have a child to protect. figure that was where that was going. Her eyes turned to light? You still have one baby left. I mean, it's not born yet, but... Huh? That's all it took to change your mind? Cool scene though. She really is beautifully animated. <laughs> oh. Not sure how many tries that took, but that was a cool escape sequence. <laughs> a little late for me to say that, but oh, and that was enough for her to sacrifice herself. Man, well, now I feel kind of bad for Kuro. It's like Rolo all over again. Except I didn't really outright hate Kuro. <laughs> Digging the music there. What does this remind me of, uh... What, that one Studio Ghibli movie, the, uh... Princess Mononoke. <laughs> and I guess it is another, like, very nature-heavy, uh, movie and all that, but... Hey, other Ori's! Gumo! I wonder if she's the last of her race, too, Naru there. Oh, look! Kubra. Oh. <laughs> she drew. That's kind of cool. And it lives in light, apparently. 
So, did Ori die? Huh. Well, I'm sure I must have gotten an achievement for that just now, but, uh... <laughs> Well, I, I don't have the internet on, so... In any case... That was a lot of fun! <laughs> I had my annoying parts here and there, but... You know what? All things considered, it's reasonably difficult. It's not, like, so difficult that it just, like... I don't know, annoys you, but... <laughs> I mean, there was a couple times where I was feeling a little annoyed, but not so much to stop me from playing, so... I think it was at least reasonably difficult. <laughs> it's kind of interesting how you're stuck in the final area there at the end, but... They sure display a lot of emotion for having, like, no real dialogue going on there, you know, other than, like, what was her name, Sign or whatever. I don't know if they may, when they went a little overboard with Kuro just kind of like changing her mind rather suddenly like that there at the end, but you know I, I really yeah I enjoyed this game a lot. I, the few minor frustrations and all, I think I probably found a lot more stuff than I thought I might for a blind run, but yeah I really enjoyed it. I'm not really sure what else to say. I love the. <laughs> Okay, maybe I do know what else to say, but <laughs> I love the artwork. I love this music playing now. Wow. Nice rendition of this song, man. Woohoo. Yeah, there's a you can tell there was a lot of love put into the artwork in this game. Dang. Yeah, nice going there. Anyway, um being since it's so close to Christmas, I'm probably going to take a little extra time off before my next project, which uh, I'll basically announce a little later, eventually, but... And maybe even a side LP as well. Ted Wolsey? Are you serious? The same one who did the translations in... Final Fantasy VI and all that? Really? He was a part of that? Whoa. Is that what happened to that company that he started that, like, failed miserably? <laughs> Did that get absorbed by Microsoft? Well, I wasn't expecting that. Dang. <laughs> I don't know if I'll ever do that game, that, that first game that his company made, that first one that is considered to be, like, the worst RPG of all time. <laughs> I mean, because it has some weird little merits, but it, it really <laughs> is bad. <laughs> oh, well. Anyway. I need to break the habit of saying anyway all the time, huh? Well... I love the abilities in this game. There were some really cool abilities in this game, man. And I love the way you really come to care for a lot of the characters, even though they get no dialogue outside of, like, the sign and the tree. But yeah, did Ori die there at the end? I mean, was that, like, other Ori's, or whatever his race is called, that we saw, or... Are we going to find out? Well, thank you! Oh. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> cool! Nice art, too. Well, I guess that's it. So, thank you all for watching Ori in the Blind Forest. Uh, like I said, I'll probably take a little time, since it's so close to Christmas, I'll probably end up taking like a week or two off before I start my next project, which I will announce eventually, even though you can just go look at it on my homepage anyway, or on, you know, YouTube <laughs> homepage, so. Until next time. Ooh, look at that! What happens when I start that again?
Oh, I can't do anything with that? Uh, okay. Never mind. 